This is an ABC 10 News update. And good evening, I'm Steve Atkinson of the ABC 10 News studio. Mexico has agreed to allow the U.S. to restart the Remain in Mexico policy. That policy, which began under former President Trump, requires many non-Mexican immigrants, migrants that is, to stay in Mexico while they await immigration court dates. Now, this comes after a federal judge ruled the Biden administration violated federal law with its original plan to end the policy. It uh, plans to appeal. Now, there will be changes to the policy, including new COVID protocols, ensuring cases are heard quickly and that migrants have access to counsel. It goes into effect on Monday. Moving to the pandemic now, San Diego's unified vaccine mandate for students will stay in place for now. Today, a judge denied an emergency request to temporarily suspend the mandate. The group let them choose as filed suit to permanently stop enforcement. They say the district doesn't have the authority to put the mandate in place and is denying personal belief exemptions. But as of now, the district's deadline for full vaccinations is January 4th. A full hearing on the issue is scheduled for December the 20th. UC San Diego is telling students who traveled over Thanksgiving to get tested for COVID despite their vaccination status. The Union Tribune is reporting the school sent out a letter to students. The letter states even though cases have not increased significantly on the, in the county or on campus, they are expected to trend upward due to fall break travel. Let's get a check on the weather. Here's Derek with your forecast. Yeah, so we're looking at some uh, morning clouds and fog both Friday and Saturday, but we've got a very nice weekend on tap for you. Very warm temperatures on Sunday and Monday because of a Santa Ana wind event. Details coming up.